Nuiqsut sits on the edge of Alaska, but it's in the middle of big changes. The remote Inupiat village is in close proximity to oil and gas development, and it's also subject to thawing permafrost, changes in hydrology and vegetation, and other effects of a changing climate. These combined forces are the focus of Alaska EPSCOR's northern test case. It's that combination of climate change and land use change that um, give us some insight into how communities are responding to those kinds of changes. Test case research stretches across physical, biological, and social sciences. Anna Liliadal models how thawing permafrost landforms called polygons are degrading, enabling water that ponds within the shapes to instead drain and impact fish and wildlife. Something that used to be relatively wet and moist is suddenly dry because the water runs off on the landscape. So that, that is a, a major change that, we've, that we see in the last couple of decades. The test case further links hydrology and wildlife through a study of lake ice regimes, research into how increased shrub extent influences wildlife, and a model of the test case study area which incorporates data on fire, permafrost, hydrology, and vegetation and uses them to project changes in plant communities. Researchers are also incorporating factors like caribou migrations, infrastructure, and hunter access to harvest areas. Those of us who are um, very in touch with what, um, what people use from the ecosystem are working with the model developers to make sure that the outputs are relevant to the things um, people use in the environment and how those changes may occur. Researchers work closely with New Exit residents whose unique lifestyle mixes subsistence hunting, fishing, and gathering with participation in the cash economy. In one project, the test case supplied local hunters with camera-equipped GPSs and asked them to photograph and log changes they viewed as important. They documented river erosion, wildlife locations, landscape changes from oil development, and even cultural events. New Ixit is, um, it has a really rich and active subsistence lifestyle. So any change in the landscape that alters the availability of those subsistence resources should, uh, should be given some attention because it, it affects the, the heart of the community. Other researchers are examining how federal policies in the Nuiqsut area incorporate and respond to local concerns with a focus on access to subsistence species. We're kind of looking at how the regulatory process has seen change on the landscape versus how um, communities have experienced and, and reacted to those changes. The test case will produce data, maps, models, and decision support tools that will be made available to local and regional organizations and that will contribute to Alaska EPSCOR's goal of studying the capacities of different Alaskan communities to adapt to change. The lessons that we can glean from our uh, understanding of New Ixit and our work with the people of New Ixit, um, have good transfer in understanding what conditions facilitate adaptation to changes and what impedes those adaptations. Um, be they at the household or individual level, the community level, or the regional institutional level.